It has helped change how we communicate. Facebook boasts more than 800 million active users across the globe. But now some North Texans will have a hand in changing one of the most important social tools of our time. CBS 11's Arzo Dost explains. At UT Arlington, students often meet face to face to discuss an academic phenomenon. <laughs> but these students will soon be working on a social phenomenon that's changed how we communicate. It's a great opportunity you know, to be associated with this research work. Most college students use Facebook to hang out with friends, but this group will help make it better. It's pretty quick as it is, and I think they're just trying to keep it up to pace as they grow. These grad students are working on research which would make uploading, downloading, really anything on Facebook much faster. We're very, very excited to be part of uh, Facebook. Dr. Daraji Aganifer is trying to find a better way to cool massive data centers like Facebook's. He says data centers account for roughly 2% of all U.S. energy use, enough to power a couple of cities the size of Austin for most of a year. You are able to put uh, uh, more uh, servers, which means you can get uh, uh, you know, better information uh, or more information, uh, more data. That translates into a faster Facebook. Facebook, there's a lot of downloading of pictures and uploading of pictures, right? This takes time. It's going to be a thousand times faster. The savings for Facebook and other companies involved could be in the millions. Changing messages every hour. For this group, it's a chance to influence the social phenomenon of their time. Arzo Dost, CBS 11 News. Facebook is pledging $50,000 toward that research. The pledge is renewable for up to five years. And by the way, Facebook is just one of 15 companies for which UTA will be doing research. Other data heavyweights are Microsoft, General Electric, and Bloomberg.